I'm Bonnie Saratori with Spiritual Acceleration. I want to share with you about the new paradigm, all right? So I was, I was discovering the new paradigm energy frequency and what it all looked like and what it would take to continue incarnating into the new paradigm as we got more and more into the new paradigm. And I was teaching psychic classes. This was back in 1987. And I was talking to the, my students about the new paradigm and how in order to be incarnating into that, we had to be at a certain level, a certain frequency within our own energy field. What that means is we are not going to be incarnating into the new paradigm, which is full of light, if we're still holding on to negativity and darkness. Okay. What that means is Anybody who still wants to be holding on to greed and hate and resentment and torturing and punishing, causing harm, all those really dark negative energy frequencies, anybody who wants to hold on to that ego, the big ego, all of those negatives, they will not be able to incarnate into the new paradigm. Okay, so here's what's happening. It's almost like there's like this veil. Okay, now the veils have been lifting and clearing for many, many, many years now. And the frequency of the new paradigm has a much more lightness to it, is light. Okay, and this veil frequency, in order to pass through it, you have to have a certain vibrational frequency to do that. So if your frequency is holding a negative, like you have a lot of dark energy in you like this, you're not going to pass through. It can't get through. This black energy is not going to pass through. That means we have to do our inner work. We must do our inner work. We must face ourselves, find those places where we got hurt, where we got wounding, shock, trauma that's causing us to hold on to beliefs that you know, that life is suffering, that, you know, that we're not good, we're not wanted, we don't matter, we're not enough, we're not loved. And then all the things that come from that jealousy and greed and punishing and hurting and torturing others, okay? So we want to be as clear as we can be, so that we can pass into and through the veils passing through, see that passing through the veils, so that we can incarnate in the new paradigm. We don't have a whole lot more time before that's actually going to be happening. In fact, right now, if there's if there's um, really, really, really dark black that people are holding on to, they're not coming through. Okay, but probably in another 100 years, another 150, 200 years, anybody holding really dark won't be passing through, okay? So right now we're in the, the purging of the world, the frequency of the new paradigm, the new world, the new earth is all co-creating, co-existing, and everything is recalibrating. The world is purging darkness, humanity is purging darkness. That's what this is all about. All the big energies that we're experiencing, all the disasters and the wars and the greed, everything we're seeing, the blaming others, this is all part of the exposure. This is all part of the purge. And as we're purging these darker energies, everything begins to turn to more light. Okay. So as we turn more light, everything gets lighter, lighter. And again, darkness won't be passing through the veils of the new paradigm, living in that new paradigm. So all the more reason, you know, to finish up, get cleaned up, clear up your unconscious, clean up your wounding, and guess where you can get that done? <laughs> SpiritualAcceleration.com. We offer so many awesome programs and so many different ways to help liberate you from your suffering. We also have lots of free gifts and lots of different things that you can explore and discover to help you on your journey to your back to your own self, to your own liberation, so that you begin to live in that frequency of who you truly are. That divine being in the very core of your being is just pure love and light. All right. Well, I hope to see you sometime. Join us at spiritualacceleration.com and see how we can help you.